Today, we're going on an adventure. All right. David, you want to show us what you got so far? This is not pink. It looks pink. It's supposed to be red. If it comes out pink, I'm going to be really upset. How's it going, Daniel? So far, it's all right. I got a green and blue dragon. I'm using this big brush. I'm kind of nervous about it, but we'll see. I'm getting in a box. It's not very exciting. Whatever. We'd be super enthusiastic. Yeah. I'm always enthusiastic, thank you. She, uh, yeah, she had no idea what was happening. 
Um, and she was like, uh, uh, I'll be right there. Hold on. And then she kept, because we went in and we just got chocolate milkshakes, because that's what David wanted, because he would live on Denise's chocolate milkshakes if he could. Um, <laughs> he's like in the background going, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, that was a really interesting experience. I don't think I've ever had an experience quite like that at Denny's before. Um, Danielle, have you? No, but I don't go to Denny's a lot. Dude, I could this like... This was the most ghetto Denny's I've ever been to. It was kind of scary. Uh, exactly, yes. <laughs> He's not exaggerating, there really is. The last time we went to this, this Denny's, there's, there's one of the front windows that has a bullet hole, like a, a big one, and we accidentally, because they were like, sit wherever you want. And so, me and the group that I was with went to sit down, and I go, why is there glass all over the place? And I was sitting right next to where the bullet came through the window. And we asked where the bullet went, and the guy goes, oh, I don't know, it happened last night. We still haven't found where the bullet went. Continue on I-435 south, five somewhere. miles. I think they, they would have known that. I might not have told you. I mean, possibly not, but I don't know, man. So this Denny's is a little shady, but I mean, at least it's not like Waffle House. Man, Waffle House. Waffle House is horrible. <laughs> like the blood could happen and Waffle House will not close. <laughs> like, it's gotta be a hell of a disaster for Waffle House to close, you know? So a friend of mine ordered uh, chocolate waffles or chocolate, was it waffles or pancakes? I think it was waffles. He ordered chocolate chip waffles, okay? Now, when, now, David here has, n had never been to Waffle House before. Um, and they showed up, and it was waffles with chocolate chips sprinkled on the top. And David goes, what the f is that? <laughs> and our friend goes, it's chocolate chip waffles. He goes, no, those are some waffles and chocolate chips. Those are not chocolate chip waffles. Um, so we had a good laugh. And there was a few other like really crazy ridiculous things that happened. Like our waiter like went to fill up our drinks and halfway back to the table, you just hear uh, he had spilled the soda all over the floor because like he filled it up and like he like rushed over and I guess it fizzed up and like bubbled over and it went all over the floor. All over the floor. Um, it was pretty funny. Fill me up. Yeah, why not? I'm kind of, like, my face gets kind of boring after a while. But, you know. Um, so, so yeah, our experience in Denny's today was, uh, oh, and, and, oh, speak of the devil. <laughs> Freaking waffle house, yeah. Um. Oh, not only that, but but the Denny's that we were at isn't making any more milkshakes for the day at all. D Danielle, go ahead and 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 tell the people what happened. Well, so we were sitting um, just at the front, two miles, and we're kind of just talking to each other. Front street. And all of a sudden, you hear this noise of some like scraping metal. Like and, an engine dying. Uh, the blender died. So the guy goes over to this other lady and he's like, I think it broke. She's like, don't tell me that. But then, I mean, I guess they they made them eventually. It took a little bit, but yeah, it's crazy. And the manager goes, the manager walks by and goes, don't make any more milkshakes. <laughs> and, and David goes, we get the last milkshakes of the day. Heck yes! And he's like so excited. It's the most ghetto thing that the friggin' blender is broken. Like nobody knows what's going on. The bullet through the window. Like nobody knows where the bullet is. It's a good time. Hello, we have arrived. 
my ram came to the house and uh, we were not there to get it, so... Oh, I'm not trying to zoom in. So we're gonna pick it up! Oh my god! It is content. Take it off. <laughs> yeah, she is. Yes. She's just taking pictures. I don't understand. I'm taking a video. Oh. That's so beautiful. I'm so excited. Thanks for hanging out with us. Uh, we had a lot of fun um, hanging out with you guys today, going and painting pottery, uh, going to FedEx, uh, talking to you guys about everything. Um, Thank you so much for editing all these videos, Danielle. You're super fantastic. Super appreciate it. Uh, any words of wisdom for everybody? Um, go spend a day with some friends. It's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, it's pretty dope. So super glad to get to hang out with you for the day and uh, with David and uh, just having a good old time. So um, we got a lot of great videos happening uh, in the future. So looking forward to all of that. Um, make sure you hit that big red subscribe button at the bottom. Um, make sure you like this video and you hit the bell notification so you get notified every time I upload a brand new video. Until next time, bye guys.